Hey guys, now I know this is a men's website and here I am at the My Little Pony booth. However, there's a phenomenon called bronies that is taking over the world. Now these are adult men who are into My Little Pony. Here's my interview with the cast and creators of the new My Little Pony on the Hub. And I think so much can be said about Lauren Faust and having the vision because having spoken with her, she, she talked about the crossover of what she wanted to achieve in general, and I won't speak for her directly, but only to say that she felt that really she wanted to sort of demonstrate where women are now and where we're headed, and include that with, with everyone to see that it is, again, not a gender-based thing, but it's just morals and values and everything that we can relate to the entire world, pretty much, and have adventure and still contain sentiment uh, and, and have that crossover seamlessly with the writer with the writers and then our, the performers uh, executing that. So it's, a, it's an amazing combination of elements that have come together in a really positive, critical mass. You know, she always, she always wanted to do this show since she was a little girl. It was her dream to make My Little Pony come to life now and in the way that she saw it and the way that included all ages and show that, you know, if guys like that show and it's dumb, does that mean girls are dumb? Like she wanted to get rid of that and cross all barriers and it's really her vision that put us there and then all of our input and the writing so amazing and the actors and, and everything that sort of come together to create something that breaks all those barriers and we love the fandom. I mean we all are just except for you on we're get, get you on Twitter. Oh we'll make on Twitter. We all talk to them on Twitter and they're so supportive and fun and we are, just love them. I love the fan base. I love that people are so interested in it, but I think they became so interested in it because we were doing something right. And I don't want to change the program um, to fit some new thing. People are going to continue to love it because we're going to continue to do what, what we started out wanting to do. It's a feel-good show, and people are just drawn to it like moths to a flame. And so clearly we a need to make that happiness. forefront. <laughs> a flame of happiness. And it's created this that whole it community. <laughs> it's, created, it's created a commu community. That's a sociological phenomenon, quite frankly. And then to try to figure out what that is that, that does is it's part of the fun because it's just, mm -hmm. it's just the end result. So there you have it, guys. My Little Pony is no longer the pastel ponies from the 80s. Make sure to check out My Little Pony Friendship is Magic and get on the brony train yourself.